All right, it is time to find a forever home for another furry friend this morning. Norman is a four-year-old hound mix up for adoption at Palmetto Lifeline. Joining us now is Maria Wooten from Palmetto Lifeline. And let me tell you, Norman is really excited this morning. He was already jumping up on Intisar. Oh, <laughs> he's really having a fun time. He's a time. lover boy, for yeah, sure. Yeah, he's precious. <laughs> yeah, so he's around four years old, a hound mix. He was found as a stray, <laughs> really in just pitiful condition. I mean, we actually thought he was much older than he, he is. We thought he was like 10, 11, 12, because he was just in, he was so frail almost mm -hmm. is the word, just so weak. Mm -hmm. And and so, um, you know, he was brought in by a, a good Samaritan who had found him. He was found with a piece of a, a rope, like a torn off rope mm. attached to him. Mm. So we think he was probably a yard dog where he just mm -hmm. wasn't really valued as a member of the family and just mm -hmm. chucked outside. Oh, wow. And he even had on one of those like rubbery orange, like you see him on hunting dogs a lot. Mm -hmm. So we think he was probably just used for that, you know. But we'd love to find him a home where he can, you know, be inside and be a member of the family for sure. Yes. Absolutely, such a sad story, Maria. And it's sometimes, you know, we miss the point too of when you guys come on every Friday, some of these animals have really been through it. That's yes. right. They've been through it. And so we really want to make sure that we are able to find them a loving home. That's right, he, he really has been through it and he deserves it more than anything. You can see that, you know, he's a little jumpy. He's never, mm -hmm. he's never had any training, he's four years old now and he just he's just lived some, in a yard his whole life you know he know. just wants love yeah. he'd love you know maybe a another dog in the home that that could teach mm. him the ways of of being a dog and being a family dog and living in the house you know we think he would do really well with other dogs he's shown some positive interactions but hasn't been directly tested but if you have a dog he would love to meet your dog okay sure. yeah norman definitely has a lot of energy i feel like he would yeah. really get along well with other dogs like yeah. you said oh, yeah. and hopefully family members there, too so yeah. do you know anything about how norman would do maybe with children um, we have not seen him with children, but you can see he is, I mean, he's, he's a little jumpy, like I said, but he's mm -hmm. very he's, gentle. He's gentle. Yes. Um, and he's very smart. Mm -hmm. So I think if you did some training with him, you know, if they're little kids, you know, just, just how to sit, just, mm -hmm. just basic things like that, you know, down, I think he would pick up on it really fast. He's very, very treat motivated. <laughs> okay. He's, he's a hound. So oh. his nose is always to the ground. You know, he loves hey. to explore. Hey. Um, he'd hey. love to have a big fence oh. backyard where he can just he's roam a... around and survey the area, you know, what hounds love to do. Yeah. Yeah. He's just so curious, Dave. He's, he's honestly not even as interested. <laughs> in the he's, he's never just, been in this in any kind of in environment. Yeah, right. he just, this, this is, is a lot for him to take in, for sure. Oh, well, like, he's... We'll get to the food later. <laughs> yeah, he said, I'm not worried about that right now. Yeah. Any health concerns with Norman, Maria? So, Norman did come in as heartworm positive, but, um, you know, luckily we have great treatments for that these mm -hmm, days, and in about nine months, <laughs> those heartworms should be gone. Today. But other than that, he is very healthy, you know, and he's only four, so yeah. he'd love to find a wonderful home. I think he would be great with some kids yeah. that would just love on him all day long. Look how sweet. Well, he oh. loves Tony. He's, he's, loving. he's loving me he's, today. I feel like he's sweetheart. the one that kind of just wants he's to crawl in your lap yeah. and, you know, can't get close enough to you. Yes. Oh. oh, my gosh. Look at Norman. He's already showing us all his tricks. He <laughs> is. He's adorable. We want to make sure that we find Norman a forever home. So if you would like to adopt him or any other pet at Palmetto Lifeline, adoptions are open from noon to 6 p.m. Tuesday through Friday and then 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. on Saturdays. And as always, for a smoother adoption experience, you can complete that adoption application online before your visit. All right.